Hey everybody, it's Russell from What Drives Us. Welcome to our little uh, peek inside the new 2023. No, it's not 2023, it's 2022. Uh, the 2022 Tundra iForce Hybrid. All this in a hybrid? What? It's true. <laughs> Welcome to What Drives Us. My name is Russell Frost. And with me today for this special one-on-one -on -one interview is Cynthia Ariano. She is, uh-oh, I'm going to be bad, the Advanced... Tech Product Educator. Advanced Tech Product Educator for Toyota, which means she's going to help walk us through the brand new 2022 Toyota. Tundra. Toyota. Now, why the 2022 Tundra? When we don't really talk about trucks, well, because it's a hybrid. This is a hybrid. It we has happened. It finally happened. Toyota truck. Well, we have a hybrid minivan, so why not? So, I know that this is not the standard HSD system that's in, for instance, the one that's, that everybody's familiar with in Prius with the planetary gears and all that. A little bit different system. Um, can you just give us the real basics of that? Yeah. So, what's exciting about the Tundra is it redefines what hybrid means, right? So, for so long, Hybrid has always been synonymous with the Prius, which is efficiency. And so with the Tundra, we're bringing you power, we're bringing you performance. And so with the Prius, we're used to having an MG1 and MG2 motor. Here, you have a single parallel motor. So that's what makes this so much more exciting. So more power for towing, more power for the truck stuff, a little more efficiency. Yeah. Sort of like the RAV4 Prime, where it was really tuned for performance, mm -hmm primarily not efficiency. It's still very efficient, yeah. obviously, but it's also the second fastest production Toyota. Yeah, absolutely. Yay. And with the power, you're able to tow. And that's what we found is a lot of our consumers use their pickups so that they can tow. And so this is a great addition. What? So this is a production. This is a production. Yeah. So Mom. it will be okay. going to sale in the spring of 2022. Okay. Okay. So we're still kind of early on though. Mm -hmm. you, there, there's some deets, like we don't know what the MPG is going to yeah. be yet. There's uh, some of the other things that we don't know. Do we know? It also has a brand new Toyota entertainment system. Yeah. Toyota audio multimedia system. So what we're looking at right here is a 14 inch screen. Which is huge, right? Yeah, like it's I enormous. I think it's bigger than my iPad. Although I am um, sitting about six feet away from you true. in the cab of a vehicle, yeah. so <laughs> bigger is better. Yeah, absolutely. So you do have Apple CarPlay, you have Android Auto, and a lot more functionality. The, the idea is that you retain all of the features that you used to, but uh, this brand new design from the ground up interface makes it a lot smoother. When I drove the, the Tundra this morning, I was impressed. The touch sensitivity seemed to be very quick, very responsive. Yes. Um, everything is just a lot. It's not as uh, horrible it's, as the old system used to be. I'm, am I allowed to say is, that? It is quite intuitive okay, and it's much very better. user friendly. I shouldn't say anything bad about the old system. I should say this is so much better. So much better. So much better. And it is. The and, user interface is really great on this new multimedia system. And, and we look forward to that as well. Now, we happen to be in a TRD all-wheel drive, I guess? We are in a limited with a TRD off-road package. So the nice part about the hybrid is it comes in four grades. So you can get it in a limited, a platinum, 1794, and the TRD Pro actually only is built in hybrid. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. So this isn't a matter of like the hybrid being done for whatever reason, for political reasons or something. I mean, there's actual mechanical advantages. Oh. Otherwise, you wouldn't put it in the pro version. Absolutely. I hope. <laughs> I um, any other differences between uh, this because of the hybrid system? So you do get 437 um, horsepower and you get right. 583 uh, pound-feet of torque. So this truck is so much fun to drive. It's very quick. Yeah. Yeah. I um, I got around this morning on my drive very, very quickly. And, <laughs> and there'll be some more video from that, of course. Awesome. Yeah, as we do that. But but I also wanted to talk to somebody because I there's not a lot of information yet. Yeah. I wanted to get a little more information as opposed to just me talking about, oh, this is fun to drive. Look, I just ran yeah. over people. Yay. <laughs> One of the main things people get trucks for is towing stuff, hauling stuff. 
Uh, and what's the, the capacity on this one? 12,000 pounds. 12,000 pounds. That's a lot of, it's a lot of whatever it is. That's a big trailer. 12,000 pounds is six tons. Yeah. That's huge. Um, that's fantastic. And do, do we know how that sex up to the old one? This, this tows more? This does definitely tow more. Tow more. Wow. Um, yeah, I believe it's 3,000 pounds more, but I can okay. get back to you that, on that. And that's fine. It, more is enough. Um, any other big hybrid differences uh, between this and the previous iterations? Obviously, this is the all-new Tundra platform, mm -hmm. too. So nothing in common with the old Tundra. This no. is designed from the ground up for this year. Not only does it have a hybrid powertrain, but everything else is new. Everything else is new. The redesign is beautiful. I think they've done a really great job with this vehicle. Well, the front's super intimidating. I it mean, is. I... Not as intimidating as you, but yes. <sighs> We're definitely editing that out. <laughs> <laughs> that that's really about all I have. Did I, Cynthia? Thank you so much for spending time with me today. Um, I, you know, th this is still an early uh, uh, version. Not all the stats and specs are out. We'll update the site with that stuff as you guys release it. But is there anything else that I didn't ask that you'd like to talk about? Yeah, I hope that your viewers come look at our Tundra. We now have a rounded out portfolio of electrified vehicles from everything from a small Prius to now this powerful Tundra battery electric that's gonna be coming soon, fuel cell electric, and plug-in hybrids. So we have a full line for everyone. Yay, more electricity. Yay, more electricity. Cynthia, thank you so much for doing that. Thanks to all of you for tuning in. Uh, until next time, drive safe. <laughs>